Tesla hinted the robotaxi story is entering a new phase and the stock just hit a 2025 high. Over the weekend, Elon Musk posted that driverless testing is underway in Austin. Yeah, that's with no occupants in the car. And this is a big shift from the earlier setup where Tesla had safety drivers. And as you can see from yesterday's move, the market loved it. Tesla shares jumped about 3.6% on Monday and closed around $475, basically sitting at near all-time highs. And here's some of the details. Tesla rolled out a limited robotaxi branded ride hall service in Austin back in June, plus another car service in the San Francisco Bay Area soon after. Tesla's official account also teased the fleet could wake up via over-the-air updates, meaning software could scale this fast if it works. But let's not ignore all the risks. Tesla reported as of mid-October, there were seven collisions involving the Austin fleet. They were reported not severe, but safety researchers say that's still a lot for a small test fleet. And of course, regulation matters too. Texas currently allows testing if they follow traffic laws, but starting May 28, 2026, Texas will require DMV authorization for commercial autonomous use. And in California, regulators say Tesla hasn't applied for the permits needed for driverless testing or a commercial robotaxi service. And here's the bottom line. Tesla is pushing forward, but they're still playing catch up to companies like Waymo. I've been riding in Waymo's here in Atlanta, as well as other cities in the USA, and it has been a fantastic experience thus far. If Tesla can pull this off, it will be a huge win for the company. But my question for you is, do you think that this Tesla robotaxi service is already priced into the stock? Let me know in the comments. Do you think Tesla still has room to rise or is it going to just drop?